Excitement enveloping everyone here because it is a huge occasion. The Champions League final. Who's going to be crowned club kings of Europe? It's Inter and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. And now the night everyone in the football world has been longing for. Millions will be watching around the world. It is, of course, the biggest final in club football, the UEFA Champions League final. Welcome to the commentary box. Derek Ray here, joined by Stuart Robson. It's Inter versus Barcelona. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. Space here for Barcelona. And Lewandowski in the thick of things. The Inter starting lineup. Jan Sommer is the goalkeeper. Alessandro Bastoni plays with Francesco Acerbi in centre defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today, Lautaro Martinez plays alongside Marcus Turan. Played over. Appeared to be in two minds. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. The corner kicks keep on coming. position Damian keeping possession of the ball with authority Turan well, possibilities in the centre trying his luck pretty routine there for the goalkeeper Lewandowski. It's with Gundogan. That's how to dispossess your opponent. Joao Felix. And possibilities inside the box. And they deal with the threat this time. And he's lost custody of the ball here. A free kick decision goes the way of Barcelona. De Jong. Now Lewandowski carries the ball forward. But can he produce from this position? I'll tell you what, it wasn't a million miles away from the equaliser. Well, it was a decent chance but they're still behind there, they needed to take that one. Ah. 
And now the visionary, Lewandowski. Well, good technique in terms of how he struck it. Alessandro Bastoni. Francesco Acerbi. Well, the scoreline means they can focus on keeping possession. Di Marco. Mkhitaryan. Martinez. Chances on. deliver it with accuracy not really the ideal clearance happy to take on the shot excellent block Sandro Bastoni. It's with a Cherby. On the ball, Bastoni. Matteo Damian. A oh, nice ball over the top. Might lead to a chance. Magnificent challenge to win it back. Christensen. This is Robert Lewandowski. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Strong play here. Alessandro Bastoni. Barella has it. Turan. Must be. And the keeper there to deal with it. for the keeper in the end. Now the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Inter have given away possession. Well, there we have it. We're at the halfway mark now here at Wembley. They get the ball rolling again. Barca's first half struggles were there for all to see. Can they make a better fist of it in this half? It's 
switching from gear to gear as he runs Mkhitaryan but they took care of the situation defensively and a good tackle now space for Inter in the wide position Mkhitaryan with the cross and he's clear his lines decides to shoot and that's a very good pass Romeo Kunde this is Robert Lewandowski promising sequence comfortable in bringing that ball down and the ball back with Inter here and teammates around him nice looking pass Martinez Martinez oh the keeper made it look routine it was anything but Rafinha Kunde. Here's Rafinha Well it's attractive football But they need effective football They need a goal They're trying to take their time But not enough care on the ball Damian Francesco Acerbi it's with Cialanolu crossing opportunity just looking for the right moment for that final pass and putting his body on the line that's a lovely ball a decisive clearance it was Barella De Frey. and here's Cialanolu The through ball. Barella. Terrific block there. Nicely timed tackle. Good strength to keep the ball. Damian. Matteo Damian. Makes the move to the inside. A routine save. Alessandro Bastoni. Matteo Damian. Oh, that one has promise. in the middle Barella Mkhitaryan in the middle danger averted for now incisive pass and he clears it out of harm's way Rafinha Oriol Romeu Lewandowski Then let's see how it affects the match. Now the short corner routine played into the center. Easy save. Chalanolu. No time just challenged magnificently. Sergio Roberto promising move from Barcelona Joao Cancelo 
He read the situation defensively and did his job. Now the counter-attack looks on. Mkhitaryan. Martinez. He's going to have a go here. And attacking with real pace and devilment. All that was missing was a goal. Well, you're absolutely right. That's how to counter-attack. It really was a great move. Frankie de Jong. Ten minutes left for play. Lewandowski. And they stopped them in their tracks. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. tackle it'll be a throw and the referee was of a mind to see whether anything would come of that but now he's going to hand out the caution and he was never going to get away with that one it's really good refereeing Lewandowski simple catch really Mkhitaryan and so into the final five minutes. Chalanolu. Well, in the closing phase, and Inter really has seen everything go to plan for them in this match. Well, they've been much the better side up to now. Some of their approach play has been excellent. They just need to control possession for these final few minutes to cap off a really good display. And it's gone behind for the corner. Over it comes. There will be one minute added on at the end. despair and heartache on the other but we've got the right winners here they fully deserved it on the night for these players well it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond well they have to make the most of this don't they it's a great feat and what an achievement for them trophy presentation the Champions League trophy awaits well just listen to the roar and this trophy is held aloft a magnificent moment here you never quite know when moments like this are going to come around the Champions League winners and these celebrations are going to go on for hours and hours and maybe into next week as well, Stuart. Well, they can afford to do it as well. They are the Champions League winners. They've been brilliant all season and now they can go and celebrate with their fans. Well, the celebrations are ongoing. I don't think they're going to be brought to an end anytime soon as they savour the moment with their supporters. And they've certainly played their part, the fans. They deserve to be involved with these celebrations. They've made so much noise here. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.